Salam guys. Salam everyone. Today we're going to the grocery store and it will be my wife's first time going to a supermarket since she came to Canada. Yeah guys, I can't wait to see the difference between the Canadian store and the Ghana market. I used to go to the market when I was in Ghana to buy food for my mom. Yeah, I remember when I was in a place called Nima in Ghana. Yeah, hey, you remember? Yeah, and it was filled with a lot of people uh -huh. buying and selling stuff outside. Mm -hmm. And some of them are even walking with food in their heads. <laughs> I had never seen that before. Oh, that's a Ghana way, babe. Mm. Oh yeah, let's go. Let's go, guys. Come along with us. Ooh, it's gonna be fun. All right, guys, we just arrived at a local food store called Maxi. Yeah, it looks big. Oh. <laughs> this is where I usually buy most of my food stuff. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. so let's get a cart. Okay. It's gonna be fun today. I'm gonna eat a lot. Imagine if this was the first time in your life you've ever seen a market fully stocked. That's because my wife is from Ghana. For decades, some Africans struggled to find basic necessities in markets. Something was 100 cities. The next moment you, got, you ask, it's not even 110. It's about 200 cities. How are we going to survive in this condition? Look at us, now there is nothing, we are starving. We can't go to school, we can't pay our transport fares, we are hungry, we are angry. And Ghana has one of the highest inflation rates in Africa. Ghana is one of the most expensive countries to live in. In February, Ghana registered the highest inflation rate in almost six years. Apple, I like it. Okay, yeah, this, this one. one. Yeah, you're gonna like it. This yeah. One. yeah. What's, what's this brown bread? Yeah, brown one. Oh. Whole wheat grain. This is the meat section. We're buying some meat. You want this one? Yes. <laughs> All right, guys, we just finished buying groceries and we are going home. Yeah. We are going to cook some food. There's a lot of varieties. And one food, they have like 20 brands of it. Wow, this is amazing. I never saw that before. <laughs> so this is all we got in the local food store. And if you want to know, the total was $188. So yes, we have um, juice. Juice, we have, and this one too. Rice, mm, some meat. Yes. We're gonna cook some, I think, pasta with meat tonight. Yes, guys, join us. We're gonna cook some plantains and pasta. Yes. You're gonna like it. <laughs>
babe. Yeah. Your food is ready. Bismillah. Bismillah. Wow. This is called special Zainab's cuisine. Really? Yes. Mashallah. I hope it's you're going to like it. It's beautiful. It's nice. I hope you're going to like it. I babe. will. I will for sure. Okay. Let me bring mine. Yeah. Bring yours. Wow. Guys, first time she's cooking for me. And she's doing a great job, mashallah. <laughs> okay, now test it. Okay, bismillah. Bismillah. Eat first. Mm -hmm. It's really good. Really? Mm. <laughs> it's really I nice. did it. guys i hope you enjoyed this video and i'm really happy that my wife served me some really delicious food mm. it was really good oh thank you and i'm full alhamdulillah oh mashallah i'm so grateful guys i'm really grateful for everything yeah. and also thank you for watching us thank you yeah, we really really appreciate assalamu alaikum see you guys <laughs> on the next one <laughs> والشفع والوتر والليل إذا يسر هل في ذلك قسم لذي حجر ألم تر كيف فعل ربك بعاد إرم ذلك